in the name of Allah, who is most beneficent and merciful. My name is Omer Beba, and my ID is 014. Today, I'm going to deliver a presentation of organic chemistry. And topic of my presentation is Heck Reaction. Basically, short explanation of this named reaction. First of all, we see introduction of the Heck reaction. The Heck reaction is the chemical reaction of an unsaturated halide with an alkene in the presence of a base and a palladium catalyst to form a substituted alkene. It is named after its discovery, Richard F. Heck, and he was awarded the 2010 Nobel, Nobel Prize in Chemistry, which he shared uh, with different scientists for their discovery and further development of this reaction. This reaction was the first example of the carbon-carbon bond forming reaction that followed a palladium catalytic cycle, the same catalytic cycle that is seen in other palladium catalyzed cross coupling reactions. And the Heck reaction is a way to substitute the alkene. Basically a coupling reaction in organic chemistry is a general term for a variety of reactions where two hydrocarbon fragments are coupled with aid of a metal catalyst, like in the Heck reaction. And you can see in this reaction, basically Heck reaction involves conversion of the terminal alkene in the internal alkene. Then we see mechanism of the reaction. The mechanism involves arcanopalladium intermediates. The palladium compound required in this cycle is generated in from a palladium precursor. For instance, palladium acetate is reduced by the triphenyl phosphine to bispalladium and triphenyl phosphine is oxidized to triphenyl phosphine oxide. In step A, it is an oxidative oxidation addition in which palladium inserts itself in the aryl to bromide bond. Palladium then forms a pi complex with the alkene and in the step B or in the uh, second step, the alkene inserts itself in the palladium carbon bond in addition step. Then follows a trigonal strain relieving rotation to the trans isomer and in the third step it is the beta hydride elimination step with the formation of a new palladium alkene pi complex. This complex is destroyed in the next step. The palladium compound is generated by reductive elimination of the palladium compound by potassium carbonate in the final step D. And during the reaction, the carbonate is stoichiometrically consumed and palladium is truly a catalyst and used in catalytic amounts. A similar palladium cycle, but with different scenes and actors is observed in this process. And this is mechanism of the Heck reaction. So what is about this cycle? This cycle is not limited to vinyl compounds. In the Sonogashira coupling, one of the reactants is an alkyne and in the Suzuki coupling, the alkene is replaced by an aryl boronic acid and in the style reaction by an aryl stannin. The cycle also extends to the other group 10 element nickel, for example, in the in other coupling between aryl halides and which is among the organo organozinc compounds. Platinum forms strong bonds with carbon and doesn't have a catalytic activity in this type of reaction. So here we see 
some applications of these reactions in the industry. Hecop links with uh, dehydrocosis, lecton, and aryl halides can produce genuinolite, says critopyl, lectons derivatives, which have been proved effective in inhibiting resistant acute leukemic cells. So, the HEC reaction can also be used to synthesize the aid of smoking cessation, like in this reaction, you can see. So, it is the brief explanation of the HEC reaction. Thank you.